If you want cheap Microsoft points and game codes, check out g2a.com. Link is in the description below. Hey guys, it's Melvin7 here, and today I'm bringing you another foot draft. Now, I do apologize, I've lost the intro. Don't worry, the next foot draft literally has a face cam. It's got live highlights, it's got everything. So the next one is going to be really good, but this one is literally the best foot draft I've ever had. As you can see, team of the year Ronaldo, team of the year Messi on the wings, and I've also got second in form Bale and third in form Neymar. I put them as centre mids and it worked so well. And Zonzi is really, really good as well. So is Benzema. The entire team was absolutely fantastic. I did enjoy it. The defence as well, very solid. It's honestly the best draft I've ever had. Highest rated, 87. So anyway, let's get into the games. All right, so the first opponent we do come up against has a fairly decent team. He's got Lewandowski and Bomiang up front. Uh, both in form a strong defence with Naldo and Umtiti there, but only 94 chemistry. And anyway, I get the first chance here. Benzema into Bale there, coming in off the centre mid roll to score. And then he turns provider here for a brilliant chest trap volley from <laughs> Diego Godin of all people. Any version of Diego Godin is absolutely insane. And then Neymar here, he's just making a mockery of the defenders. Unfortunately for him, Marcelo takes him out. It's a penalty. Ronaldo's the default penalty taker. And there you go. Easy as you like. 3 0. But then in fairness to my opponent, he does get back in it. I make a stupid error. He gets a penalty, makes it 3 1. But it didn't really matter too much, Benzema. I tried to uh, shoot there, but it's a nice tackle. It comes out to Nzonzi, who's honestly, he was everywhere in this team. Absolutely fantastic. This time, Benzema outstrengthens his defender, makes it 4-1 by smashing that in. Messi, a bit good that he's not getting in on the action. I tried to reborn of this, but it comes out to Benzema, and that's a cheeky back heel there. 5-1 to win it. A brilliant start to the draft, and we continue in. And then he's got Hero Ronaldo, this guy, he's got Bale, Benzema, you know, this is one of the average teams in foot draft now, a really good La Liga side, but anyway, uh, onto the quarterfinals, as I say, and nothing much happened, it took forever for me to break him down, and I had to sweaty it to make it 1-0, Ronaldo, I thought I did miss originally, but then in Zonzi, he was unbelievable, he just cuts inside and smashes it as though he's team of the year Ronaldo to make it 2-0, not a lot happened in that game, but it's a solid win to take us into the semi-finals. I was happy enough. And then the third team, this one's a bit better. He's got team of the year Ronaldo, team of the year Messi, in form Neymar, and a strong defence again. But I do manage to get the breakthrough here. It's it's stupid from his keeper. I don't know what the hell he's doing. He's trying to dribble out. Benzema tackles it. 1-0. Easy as you like. But this opponent didn't give up, and Messi plays it in, and this... I have, uh, honestly, what the hell is that? My goalkeeper teleports into the net. Look, literally, he's got the ball, he's caught it, all of a sudden, jumps into the net. That is EA AIDS at its finest, and that really did piss me off. And then, I give away a stupid foul. Messi takes it. He was the one who created it, and yeah, 2-1, and I thought the worst at this point, but... And nevertheless, I did get back in it, a uh, uh, foul from him. Honestly, four penalties in this episode, I think. Two apiece for opponents and me, and I make that 2-2 by smashing it in. But then Ronaldo makes it 3-2 to him, and again, I got so annoyed. But literally, straight from the kickoff here, I think this is Messi with a terrific turn there. Comes out, it's a bit lucky, but Neymar plays it through to Benzema, and it's 3-3. I deserved a little bit of luck after that AIDS-ridden goal before. And then... A brilliant ball from Nzonzi to send Messi away. Great turn away. He's inside. He's got so much space. What is he going to do? Finesse that in to make it 4-3. And that is how that game ends. So we move into the final. Honestly, I was so happy I won considering that AIDS-ridden goal. I, I couldn't believe that went in. But anyway, into the final we go. And it's the worst team yet. 59 chemistry. He's got Team of the Year Messi up front. He's got Team of the Year Iniesta. Some dangerous players, but no chemistry. So I thought this was going to be easy, but I didn't realise how easy it actually was going to be. And, yeah, I make it 1-0 early on. And again, I showed that highlight from the Nzonzi tackle. He creates so much, plays it through to Ronaldo, and there he's got an assist. Nzonzi is so good on this game. I can't highlight that enough. But anyway... He does manage to get a goal back. It's 2-0 currently, but I, I just couldn't get anywhere near him. Marco Royce, I got a bit annoyed with myself at that goal. So I thought I'd take it out on the opposition by scoring a fuck ton more goals. And that's exactly what I did. Messi starts it off here. It's a great save. Comes out to Ronaldo. Maybe a, a bit of luck there to make it 3-1. But nevertheless, and Zonzi... Again, you're hearing the name Anzonzi so much, but look at that. He's just playing as though he's Messi, Ronaldo and Neymar all combined. 
4-1. Anyway, Bale wants to get in on the act. You know, he hasn't done much since the first game. Smashes it in to make it 5-1. Straight from kickoff, literally, I tackle him. Benzema, he wants to get in on the goals. You can understand why. A little bit of luck getting the ball back, but smashes that in to make it 6-1. And I'm not done there. Messi here. I'm just running, literally, just running forward, smash it in, easy as you like, 7-1, and it's not over yet. A great ball into Ronaldo, well, it's not really that great, is it? It's just a nice ball through. Ronaldo, another Berber spin, I, I, I like doing them quite a lot. Again, a little bit of luck to get it back, smash it in, make it 8-1, and then he gets a consolation right at the end to make it 8-2, but I wasn't too bothered. That's the highest victory I've had in the final of foot draft unbelievable i was so happy i was really expecting some big big rewards and as we open this we we don't we we literally get a, a fucking premium gold players pack and a mega pack i was very annoyed with that it's a 35k pack and a 25k pack considering how i won the final i thought they'd be a lot better and uh, unfortunately they weren't so in the first pack we get radamel falco there 83 rated not too bad but he, he basically goes for like discard near enough this uh, time at FIFA, especially during Team of the Year. And then we open the 35k pack. I wasn't expecting anything, but in fairness, we actually got an inform. Now he's Discord, so we're definitely getting more than 15k back. So I, w I was pretty happy with that, considering the rewards could have been a bit better, like a 50k, 100k pack. For what we got, it, it's not too bad. It's certainly the best draft I've ever had so far in terms of the team, in terms of the gameplay, and in terms of the rewards. Uh, for winning an online draft. I've had better winning an offline draft. I got Gareth Bale, but on the online draft I've never had an inform as a reward I don't think so I was very happy with that hopefully you do enjoy stay tuned for the next foot draft because that is brilliant it's got some great reactions throughout with the face cam so hopefully you do enjoy that let me know what videos you do want to see subscribe if you haven't already like the video and yeah peace